how do we change the default front page for your Drupal site? Um, and why might you want to do that? Well, so far, okay, so far what we've been doing is we've been publishing articles here, and all these articles are showing up kind of in, you know, on the front page in reverse chronological order, without exception of that article that we made sticky up here. And that's that's the way you would expect, for example, say a blog site to work, right? Or maybe some type of site that's incredibly news generated, you know, or news driven. Um, you would expect that your front page content would change a lot and would always reflect the latest stuff that you've published. And that makes a lot of sense. And in most cases, in the way that the web works now, in most cases, that's probably the way you want to leave it. But let's say you're building a site for someone and they want their front page to be static. In other words, they want the front page to just be, welcome to our site, this is what this page is about, click here if you want to do all that stuff, whatever, okay? And that's certainly possible to do. I'm going to show you how you do that, okay? Um, the way that you would do that is you would go to configuration. And you probably remember this if you've been following the screencast series. You remember when we went to configuration and we went to site information, okay? And down here, there's a thing here that said default front page. And what this is, is that this is where you would enter the address for the page that you want to show up as your front page, okay? Now, I don't ha currently have something, so I'm gonna close that. And let's say, let's create a front page. Let's say I'm just gonna create a welcome page. It's just gonna be a static welcome page. So because it's a static page, that is just a basic page. We're gonna use the basic page content for that. I'm just gonna ca call it welcome. And let's just put some dummy content in there, okay? It doesn't have to be long, how about that? And I'm gonna leave that like that, that's good. Hit save, okay? And this is where, okay, we've got our welcome. This is what I want on the front page, okay? It's not very exciting. We can dress that up later. That's fine. And here we see, remember when we've talked about aliases and earls and things like that? Um, this content is node slash six, six because it's the sixth piece of content uh, that we created. But I certainly wouldn't expect, uh, you know, I wouldn't expect to be able to remember that. Um, so wouldn't it be useful if we actually changed this Let's to and gave it an alias, something logical like welcome, because I'm actually going to remember that. So let's change that. I'm going to go down to Earl path settings. And I'd just like to create a little alias that just says welcome. Okay. And so now this makes a lot more sense to me. Okay. The front page is just going to be called welcome. Okay. Um, so that's good. Welcome is what we want. If we go back to the home page, currently front page is just showing a default that feed of articles. Let's go change that. Let's say that our client or whatever has requested that the front page be a static page. I'm going to go to configuration. And remember we went to site information. And here we see default front page. What are we going to enter in there? What do you think? Yeah, we're going to just put the word welcome because that's the alias we created. We could have put node slash six. That would have worked as well too, but I'm not very good remembering numbers. So we're going to scroll down, save configuration. And okay, let's see if, okay, it tells us configuration options have been saved. Let's close this. So let's see what happens. Look at that. Okay. I'll just go back to the front page, get rid of that, that hashtag. And our front page now says welcome. Okay, where did our feed go? Where did all our articles go? Oh, well, we, the articles haven't, haven't disappeared. They're just not accessible right now. Again, because we haven't really built any navigation. Uh, we will be talking a lot about building navigation in future screencasts. But, um, but suffice it to say, don't worry. Your content is still there. Let's click on the content button. See, all your articles are still there. They're all still there, okay? They haven't disappeared. It's just that you can't access them right now, okay? Uh, and we'll learn how to create good navigation for your users in a future screencast. But in the meantime, now you know how to change the default front page for your site. So I hope that that was helpful. Thank you very, very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.